Hello guys! I'm gonna show you today how to repair a Shrey Mobile Snap! Snap! You see that? Snap! So what happened to this phone? My customer says that his brother played with his phone and tried to open it by putting wrong patterns on the unlock unlock patterns on the phone before you can open it yes so what really happens is this too many patterns attempts to unlock sign in with your google account so that is just awesome <laughs> his brother is really awesome so this really happens if anyone tries to put a wrong pattern on your phone so to fix this if you really doesn't know your username or if you tried any username it doesn't work you'll just follow the following steps click the username button oh you, it's not a button it's um it's just a blank space you know <laughs> so type anything from it can you see what i'm doing type just type anything type anything i'm just gonna make this clear uh okay that just type anything completely anything i know you can't see it here but that is just awesome you just have to type just just completely anything on your phone then click this edit 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 button which is in a pencil click the pencil and click the select all you have to click the select why you can yeah that select all click the select all copy and paste 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 so what the hell I'm doing so you have to do this um simultaneously so how we do it select all copy paste select all copy paste select all copy paste select all copy paste select all copy Pay 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 just do it fast then then just do what I'm doing just just press everywhere in your touchpad just just like that just like that just like that I like that song just like that just like that until it shuts down of course that will happen that is part of the repair so the phone shuts down unexpectedly no it's it was expected really and then you just have to wait you have to wait 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 and wait and wait oh yes I, I just want to press the power button Press the power button. Press the power button and press the power button. Oh, it's just you have to wait because the phone so the phone was I don't know what really happens there it was just part of the repair. Click the power button. Too many talking. Yes, I'm talking too much because this is really, really, really 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 long what long what long long it is really 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 so if you really want to sk skip this part the waiting time or the waiting part you just go to I don't know the time so I'm just pressing the power button here can you see it and trying to open it oh there you are then if this happens you have to just click the the home button repeatedly yes i'm clicking the the home button and there you are you just enter into your phone without by by just bypassing the google option so you will have to do is click that home button 
and your phone has been accessed without factory reset or resetting your phone so what you're gonna do here is click this again and take note you have to have a Wi-Fi connection so how you do that just slide from the top part and click the Wi-Fi if you click the Wi-Fi it has to be green so it's it's you can probably see it on the screen it's green and then it's connected I'm it's connected to my um to my internet connection which is there and to my Wi-Fi and then which the next step would be click settings and accounts and sync and there is a boom so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna show you that there is an email account there which is sunny consejo at gmail that blah 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 that account belongs to my customer that didn't work so what I'm gonna do is add an account if you can read the add an account it's just here click add account then select Google next so remember you have to be connected on Wi-Fi so it's asking to connect to Wi-Fi then click connect to Wi-Fi then you will select a network on oh, not that select a network to connect to so you can scroll down so it's it's connect it will be connected on the gads bro so it's my my Wi-Fi click connect what the hell is that song so connecting IP address and it's connected so you just press next and sign in so probably you have illegal not illegal uh, Ill Ill illegal Google account so you just select sign in put your username enter your username in it so I'm just gonna enter my username what the hell I'm doing So I'm not gonna show you my password, of course. Just wait, I'm doing this. Yeah. No, not that. What the hell is wrong with this touchpad? Speaking the wrong letter. So then I've entered my password. So I'm gonna click done and sign in it's loading it's loading i'm not in that your phone is to communicate with google server to set up your phone this may take up to five minutes really five minutes no it's not five minutes so you yeah, just have to wait it's not five minutes Okay, it's taking too long. But it's night five minutes. I'm gonna synchronize on my Google account, which is a illegal. Not not illegal. It's illegal. So to do this, to repair this phone, you really have to have um, an existing Gmail account on the internet. Not. A, not to create one from your phone but to sign in an existing account so it's been been a while now you can skip this part so I'm gonna skip this part okay okay and I'm back another so next step would be 
that. So you can put a check on everything. Check sync contact sync Gmail sync calendar. And then click finish. Finish setup and you're signed in. There you are. You're completely signed in. It has a green button on the Christian Joshua Gannon. No, that's not my Gmail account. Yes, it's, yes, it is. And you just click back. Back and back. So what you're gonna do now, can you see this wire? I put this to let my, that's not my phone, to let the phone phone's screen open. So if I remove this and click on the power button and click again, it will ask for the Google account again. So what you're gonna do is click on the username and put the account that you have entered lately. Christian Joshua. Good then at 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 gmail dot not an X. That com. Okay, you gotta put my password and I'm not gonna show you what it is. I'm entering it. I'm still entering it. Okay, it's done. And then what will I do is click the sign in. Sign in. Um, sign in. Checking. It's 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 still checking. The hell it is. Still checking. Still checking. Still checking. Still checking. Still checking. It's still checking. And there it is. It's asking for a new unlock pattern. So you just just do any pattern that you want and it, click continue and put it again. Click confirm and your phone is good. You can use it again. Just remove this wire and you can turn off your Wi-Fi. Turn off the Wi-Fi and click back and you can click the power button again and click it again and enter the pattern that you just made and your phone is back so I'm just a technician and I'm gonna remove my account from his cell phone so if you're a technician just click the account my account and I will remove it Click remove account and remove account. I removed it. And then his phone is back. It's completely usable now. No data that have been removed. The messages are still there. You can see it. I'm not asking for that. Messages are still there. And take note you just to be safe, remove the memory card and your sim card before doing this this and there it is i hope it helps just click like or subscribe this is my first video subscribe if this video helps you it's quite long but it really works thank you